What's up guys, it's Dragonfly Mike 77 today I'm doing a tobacco review. I'm doing a 421 Apple Balm Squared, which is like a double apple. Uh, I've had this for a pretty long time and I've been meaning to do the review and I just I keep forgetting about it. Um, with that said, uh, I actually really like this flavor. Um, as I said, I, tr I try to do as many double apples as I can just because that's kind of what I always smoke. Uh, it's something that I've smoked for the flavor double apple, Nakla especially. I've been smoking for so long, it, it's pretty much always in my stash. The only reason that I don't have it is I run out. Um, I always try to have a double apple around and we'll take a poke for you guys. Four twenty one has great clouds. Um, it takes heat really well. Uh, it is a more modern style t type tobacco, um, and this is the only flavor that I've had by them. And I actually, as I said, I really like this double apple. When it comes to other double apples, I always feel like they're too heavy on the anise, or they're too heavy on the apple, or it doesn't smoke well. There's always it just doesn't compare to Nakla double apple. Now. This one actually does. I think out of all the brands that I've tried, this is the closest to not the double apple, and I think that's why I like it so much. It just, it's new, it's not too strong on the Indies. It's definitely there. And the apple, uh, I'd like to say, is actually a little stronger than a Nakla double apple, but it's not overpowering. It's still a good balance between the anise and the apple. I'll take another poke for you guys. It tastes very clean too. Um, it, it's kind of hard to explain what I mean by clean, but it's just a crisp, mellow smoke. It has a lot of flavor to it. It has the normal double apple in your face flavor, but again, it's not so strong where I'm sitting there and I'm like, whoa, whoa, tone it back a little bit. The balance on this flavor is really good. And because of that, I actually really want to try a lot of their other flavors. Um, they don't have too many flavors. It, it's a relatively new company, and it's not like they have 40 different flavors. In fact, I think they only have like 10 or 12 flavors, which is nice for a new brand. It means that you don't have to spend a lot of money to learn what the brand is all about, and because of that, I really like that. They didn't start out trying to come out with just, you know, 30 different flavors. They started out with a few flavors and they're building on top of that which I like to me it seems like they'll have I don't know I just feel like they're working on each flavor individually and they're giving more time to each flavor than a lot of the other brands out there are doing they're not really in a rush to come out with a lot of flavors they're not trying to match different flavors on the market. They're not trying to just bombard the market, which I do like. Take another poke for you guys. As you can see, I do get good clouds. Another reason I really like it is it mix really it mix mixes really well with my black leaf, which is very important with double apple. That's normally how I smoke it. Normally I mix sag in it, uh, saloon plain, con, I mix something like that in a lot of a lot of times when I smoke double apple. Right now this is just a 421 apple bomb squared. And as I said it smokes well. It smokes really well with black leaf, which is very important to me. That's probably my default mix, that's one of my favorite mixes, I've been doing it forever, and it's something that I just don't get sick of. So the fact that I can take this double apple and mix it with my black leaf is another really big positive on it. It's something that, again, it adds to the flavor to me. It, it makes it a thumbs up for me, guaranteed. Take another poke for you guys.
It is. This is a really good double apple. If you do like Nakla double apple, but you're a new smoker and the buzz is just a little too strong for you, I really recommend 420 Apple Bomb squared because it does have a little squared on it. Um, it. It's a good way to introduce yourself to a double apple flavor, trying to almost getting that traditional double apple flavor, yet you're not going to get bombarded by the buzz. So that's a really big positive for me. That's something that, as I said, I really recommend it for newer smokers. Um, I think that's all I got. As I said, it's definitely a thumbs up. And please comment, like, and subscribe. And as always, guys, peace out.